Amazon. Where, where, where warriors wear beads and feathers in their hair, hanging in a single pigtail down their arching back. Pudding bowls of antes serve the mass. Escaping basilisks run like little men, upright in their fleeing to the water. Giant anacondas loop. Flower kissers, flying backwards, sip the nectar from a fringe of petal. Fish swim high along the forest floor when rainy season floods about. Out of time, the condors fly forever. Steamers ply along the river, buoyant long beyond the rubber boom. Where the negro meets the Amazon, dolphins play in clear tea water. Rafts of cattle float above the oxbow until the land comes flooding back, driving piraruca fish away. Vulture kings inspect beyond their orange feature. Macaws hang down a line liana like bright washed jewels, screeching blue and red and green. Fiery orange cock of the rock patrol. Helmeted as Roman soldiers, toucans bill and couple in the canopy. Nomadic hunters sporting lip discs, slash and scar their naked bodies into beauty. Kamayura artists decorate with paste, crushed from uruku seed and kneaded. Bodies needing vivid patterns set in red. Chivaro still hide shrunken heads of enemies to keep possession power. Kayapo brandish war cudgels, wooden like their spears dancing, to claim the help of forest spirits. Orchid flowers in waxy languor, lavender and mottled red, with red and yellow throats, linger on a line of stem. Groups of brightness here and there, high above the forest floor. Heliconias, beaked like parrots or macaws, dangle long their redness and their yellow. Sloths hang beneath a branch, considering slowly if moving is an option. On the Orinoco, shanty towns still above the water, sheltering behind canoes painted startling forest colours. Mud skippers hop around the mangroves where scarlet ibis gather, flapping into air. Silent, ghostly, giant egret wait for fish. Crocodiles smile smiles of smugness. Manatees float gentle in the water. A gold miner, taller than his mule, rides into El Calau, gold hung across the saddle. Butterflies drink liquid from the eyes of yellow-spotted side-necked turtles. Black piranha dagger teeth at vegetation. Vampire bats, poised, pig-nosed, above wounds they open, fan gentle wings in frenzy. White wakari monkeys, apoplectic in the gloom, rest on branches in the shade, like Englishmen in clubs, snoozing. Naked in the river shallows, children play, cooling where the water rushes. Jaguar women wearing whisker spines stare beneath black fringes at human meat Maya and our people used to eat. A shaman calls the spirits to drive the sickness out, as women bunching herbs near breathing practice what the shaman claims. Swarming butterflies, twin petals fly, flocking into fruit. Armadillos work burrowing and floating in the water. Where once a wilderness brought only life and death to generations of the tribes. Where feathers were the wealth which people took, values forsaken in a headlong rush to promise. Progress into silent forest. Slash and clear to take the best, leaving all the rest as debris. 
butterflies and hyacinth macaws, trees to choose the best canoe from, strangler figs without a palm to climb, herbs and tortoises all die, cultures vanish into Coca-Cola, anacondas wither in the sun, arrow poison frogs are lost, and tiny monkeys taught to die, to leave the human breast alone. For this, the priest returns in white, dons his red, and spreads his master's wing. The banker brings his box to fill, the woodsman brings his saw, the doctor brings the western way, the Amazon brings itself. <laughs>